welcome back, everybody. My name is Steven Zeller. I'm here on Steven's Photography Tips. Today we're going to talk about a quick tip on how to whiten teeth in aperture. I had a reader on the blog who asked, what can I do to whiten teeth? I can't figure it out. And so what I want to do is I want to just address that in case you don't want to go into Photoshop or uh, another program to be able to whiten teeth. You can take care of it all right here in Aperture. All right, so we'll go ahead and get started. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in on my photo here to 100% by hitting Z on my keyboard. We'll bring it right over here, and I'm just dragging my uh, photo over here so I've got my teeth centered up. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hit H on my heads-up display, and that's going to bring up my adjustments panel. And notice I have adjustments selected. And what I'll do is I'll go ahead and grab my adjustments, quick brushes, and we're going to go to Dodge. Now what Dodge is going to do is Dodge is going to go ahead and lighten things up for us a little bit. And it's changing the luminance values rather than changing our color. So with Dodge selected, I've got a brush size of 8. You can make it any size you want. Uh, softness of about 0.5 and strength of 1. And I have detect edges selected. And I'm going to go in here and I'm just going to gently kind of paint over my teeth. And you'll see it updating here as I go along. And I'm going right up to the edges with my brush here. And by detecting the edges, what Aperture is not going to do is Aperture is not going to go onto your lips or the gums or anything like that and allows you to go through and get everything on the teeth that we want to get. And I'm just going to go to each one of the teeth along here and just paint in this, this luminance or dodge. It's kind of like painting with a mask in Photoshop. Just going right along there. Get these last two teeth over here. Aperture kind of takes a little while to update there. But it does eventually update for you. And that's that. All of our teeth are whitened, so we're going to go ahead and close out this window. And then we're going to hit Z on the keyboard to zoom back out at 100% because we want to see the effect of what we had on our photo and how it looks. Now to me, the teeth stand out just a little bit too much, so I'm going to go over here to my adjustments panel, and with my dodge, I'm going to dial back that selection down to, say, maybe about 0 0.24, 0 0.25, right around in that area. And that looks a little bit more realistic. They look a little whiter, but it's, it's not so stark white that I'm going, oh gosh, you know, somebody definitely went in and retouched the teeth. Now to double check it, I'm just going to uncheck it, look at my before, Check it again and look at my after. Make sure it's, I still am happy with the results again before, after, and just make sure that everything looks good. And that's it. That's all there is to it. So I hope you enjoyed this tip on how to whiten teeth in aperture. And it's a little bit different because we're normally working in Lightroom and Photoshop. But uh, thanks to our reader asking the question, we went ahead and took care of it. So hope you guys enjoyed the tip. Have a great day.